us the gold standard for diagnosing endometriosis. <laughs> okay, so endometriosis is when cells that are similar to the cells in the lining of the uterus are growing outside the uterus. And we don't know how they get there. There's lots of different theories. But my favorite new theory is maybe that... Um, People are just born with the cells in the wrong place. And the problem is that every month when the lining of the uterus sloughs off and a woman has a period, those endometriosis cells are bleeding too, but they're mm. in the wrong space to come out the vagina. They're trapped in her belly, internal oh. bleeding. Blood in the belly can cause pain and irritation. And over time it can cause fibrosis, which is like a thickening or hardening of the tissue. It can also cause adhesions, which means organs are stuck together when they should be kind of moving freely. That's the gold standard for diagnosing endometriosis. But it... Um, the problem with ablation is that often the endometriosis nodule is growing deeper than the surgeon is expecting. And so when you excise it, you can make sure you get the whole thing out versus if you just burn it, you might just be treating the surface. And then if there's any surrounding fibrosis, which is that thickening or hardening of the tissue around the endometriosis from all the inflammation, I remove that as well, which provides additional pain relief versus surgeons who just burn it 